be? It's because nobody was nobody had it up. Am I oh! This was try to do hard. We hundred percent can clear. Ooh, I think I'm. Oh, fuck. I'm, I'm, I'm fucked. Did you? That was bad. Did you kill a mob? Right. I'm at two out of three. I'm out. Well, I think I did damage at least. You guys should maybe clear. I don't know how this. Block. Let's go, uh, let's go. Burst, 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 burst. Just burst. Let's go. I fucking one skull. Woo! Let's go. Let's go. Good job, everybody. Good shit. Let's go. I see it. Good job. Good job. Let's go. Nice. I didn't get anything, though. I did not get anything. I also got nothing. I did not get anything. Nothing. Uh, nothing. Oof. Let's go. Okay. I what I did. I didn't want to jinx it, but I just got deathless. Oh, yeah. yeah. Does it count as an achievement? No, unfortunately not. It's a wedding! Yay! All the way back to when I was in Reddit. Dang. <laughs> well, starting. I got another one. Oh my god, please can I have it? Seraph, 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 give me Seraph, Seraph! Fuck! Oh my god, oh my god, it's here again. Please, please. Oh, pl is there a- oh, okay, there's an ultra fine, I'll buy that too. Please, I've been opening these boxes forever. Please give me a Seraph, B rank Seraph. Seraph, 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 Seraph. Another King Clay. Hello, everybody. Am I here? And welcome back to another episode of Road to Max Damage. The Marvel Machine is back, and I decided that you know, since I'm actually doing pretty well on the Bean Brigade department, and I'm consistently getting my monthly Bean Brigade, I figured you know what, we should use some of that NX for fun, and I'm gonna spin the Marvel Machine uh, to uphold the tradition of Road to Max Damage. Except I'm just gonna spin it once. I can't really see myself gambling for a slot machine that doesn't really give me anything good. I mean, there's just one item, and what are the chances that I end up getting that? Before we get into the spin, I, w I just need to talk about something with uh, my progression, and I'm doing a lot of fence-sitting again. You guys remember when I was fence-sitting about my CRA pants and stuff like that? Well, this time, it's a little bit more bigger in the grand scheme of things. Right now, I'm sort of on the fence about whether or not I should save up a lot of meso to 22 star my arcanes, or if I should sell all the mesos I have and use the maple points and NX or whatever to cube the last remaining projects of uh, my equips. Things that are missing is just the main pot for my arcane shoulder and my uh, CRA hat, but then for B pots, there's like a lot of B pots that I want to convert from one line to two line. So, yeah, it's a really tough decision, and I want to see what you guys think. I'm more leaning on the saving uh, Mesos for Star Forcing thing because my mind is thinking, well, I better just save it now and then you get it done first because in case um, Meso keeps going up and up and up then uh, it would technically be better to work on the Star Force then. But then, after that, then I have to consider, like, oh, what if bots come back? What if Nexon actually does lower the Star Force cost for GMS? So, it's... Uh, I, I don't like that. But then, on the other hand, if I use the Mesos for uh, NX and Maple Points and stuff like that, then it'd be, okay, well, what if the Vessel rate gets better and better? So... Maybe I should have waited to sell. Actually, no, it's the same exact things I have to think about. So it's just like, damned if I do, damned if I don't. I have to pick a side. Anyways, that's just been uh, what's been on my mind recently. So, wait, why am I... Anyways, with that aside, let's go buy... Why do I have 100k? Oh, what do you know? July's Bean Brigade NX came in at the perfect time. They wanted us to spin the Marvel machine. <laughs> Waste it all. <laughs> Prepaid is now super valuable to me because of how they're working 
the purchase limitations of Q packages and stuff like that. The only way to fund other accounts to buy the Q packages and uh, Q on those accounts is if I use prepaid and gifted Maple Points to them. So uh, using prepaid is sort of like a no for me. And I'm going to try and use as much Maple Points as possible whenever I can. But as is tradition, we shall spin the Marvel Machine. Or we could use one month's worth of... Ooh. No, 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 no. Just one. So there we go. We have the one spin. And let's refresh for good luck, as they say. And let's see what we get. Here we go. Probably nothing. Two red cubes, a Valentine's Surprise style box, and a red U slot. All right, no win, and that's it. I don't care. I'm not sure if it's self-control or if it's just total apathy towards complete RNG and random bullshit like that, but it's really nice to see that I'm really just not taking the bait. But we'll see. What did I get? What the fuck? Let's throw the red cubes into my shoulder. Uh, the other two red cubes are from uh, Fairy Bros, so I guess that's pretty good timing. But let's see how we do. I still have uh, that ring to work on, uh, to work on, but I'll, I'm saving masters for that. No, nope, nothing. Truth be honest to you guys, I my game plan is really just waiting for Violet Cubes uh, in the Black Friday sales to try and cube uh, my hat and my shoulder. Preferably my hat, just because, you know, hats are really trash for normal cubing. So I might just sacrifice the 21 strength for a piece of mine maybe anyways there's a lot to get done this intro clip has gone too far long so let's get going marvel is live and underway everyone's getting the good stuff probably people drop in like you know a crap ton more annex than i will so that's why they're getting the big items honestly one of these days maybe i should pull the trigger ah but wait that's exactly what nexon wants you to think eh, actually do whatever you want i'm not your father or whatever Oh, something sewed. Cool. Something big, maybe? Please, or a tiny thing? Really tiny thing. <laughs> I have a lot of Rise Coins, and I don't have much to do with them anymore. And in fact, today is my last day of doing the Pixel Coin Express, so I get another thousand coins to work with. And I've been thinking... And this is the thing with events, you know what, like, uh, how a lot of people say, oh, if you're free to play, then you have to take advantage of events and try to make money out of it and stuff like that. Well, unfortunately, you can't really do much with this. So I've been thinking a lot about, you know, what can I do to make the most amount of money and, uh... Not much has come into my mind. But we have a random damage skin box with a couple of good uh, damage skins. And we also have a damage skin extraction. Now, before this recording, I like d dwelled on what would actually make me more muscles if I bought the saloon boxes or if I bought the damage boxes and stuff like that. Long story short, well, I'm in the shop. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be opening damage skins and seeing if I end up with a good one. And if it's a good one, then I'll extract it and, you know, stash it somewhere and hoard it. And then uh, I'll sell it later. So the first one is a remnant. How do you spell remnant? Oh, there we go. How much is this damage skin? Whoa. And I thought uh, the Keyboard Warrior would be the most expensive one. Uh, how, what is the Keyboard Warrior's price? Oh, okay. So maybe I'll hold on to this for now, but let's buy some more damage skins. Now the extraction's a th Why am I lucky on all the wrong things? Okay, well, that's already done. I only wanted one uh, copy of De Keyboard Warrior, and I guess Remnant 2. Well, I, I, I guess that's it. I, I'll i just buy one more, and if I end up getting... Okay, that's, that's a lot more better. Okay. 
Uh, so here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna buy two of these extractions. Oh, we are going to go ahead and apply these damage skins. And now they went from transferable within world to completely tradable. Somewhere someone just got really angry and be like, Oh, that's my secret missile making method. Yeah. And uh, we'll do the remnant as well. And extract. Voila. And all I have to do is just reapply my favorite damage skin. That went super well, and I, I don't know how to react to that. I guess I'm opening a crap ton of uh, Salon boxes now. Salon. God damn it, why do I keep saying it wrong? In you go, and in you go. So let's see if we can get that coveted Inkwo coin for that 200 mil, was it? I'm not sure how much is it. But, you know, if I get some other goodies like cubes, nodes, and whatnot, I'm pretty happy. Actually, spell traces too. I would be pretty happy. Anyways, this is gonna take me a while, so I will BRB. Six hours later. All right, just an update. I'm down to 3,000 coins now, and uh, this is my loot for the most part. I used one of the Master Craftsman's cubes, and I got another one because I ran out of space. It actually made me realize something. I don't think I'm really going to get the Inkwell coin. So you know what I'm also going to do is I'm actually going to get the Notestone box. And I'm going to do it to just get some Notestones and hopefully just save up some tradable ones or make some up for uh, fragments so that I can uh, maybe potentially uh, work on Paladin nodes that's what's been on my mind recently actually anyways now that i have the mitras or mitras box now uh i'm just going to get the rest of these boxes and i'll be right back all right this is the last of the boxes as i suspected no inkwell coin come on i was pulling a one in how much is that one in two thousand chance it's not I wasn't going to get it within a few thousand coins. You have to be really lucky to be able to land that. And it would have been nice if that was like the perfect timing for uh, it to show up. But hey, I got some stacks of spell traces, which is kind of nice because I've been using a lot of them recently for just random stuff. But in the grand scheme of things, I have, well, let's take away the five here. So I, I got nine node stones out of it. Yeah, big whoop, I guess. Four bonus echo cubes, that's also a big whoop, I guess. Kind of depressing, actually, if I have to say so myself. Anyways, that's more or less going to be the rise event for me. I'm going to keep opening uh, boxes, and if I do get something good, I'll note it. But yeah, I don't expect much. <sighs> I can only be happy for others. Cry. Dramatic crying with marvel underway i become a little bit more sad because dark no price has dropped <laughs> i honestly don't know what i want to do with my soul because it's so hard to get one and all of a sudden marvel just floods it in i might just hold on to this for a while a very long while and hopefully when it all blows over, they'll go back up in price. And because of Marvel, Magnificent Lucid Souls went down to 1.1 bill too. I'm a loser. Got another lackluster. Please, Seraph. I've opened so many of these now. Please, Seraph. Seraph! Ah! Oh no. That was really bad. Fuck! We got a lucid then. roid from, uh, from lucid. Ooh. Really? Yeah. I didn't even get to see this prompt in chat. Bash looted it. He got messaged by his guild. Why are you not coming to GPQ? <laughs> 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 Give like, he's a... I think he was the rank above member. Or, like, the rank above the very lowest. And I Jason feel like said, I remember that wow. having permission. All right. Oh, How are we on skulls? I got one. What the? All right. Yo. I'm not oh, Mike's about to die out. <laughs> about to die out. All right. Uh, I'm gonna start taking. Yeah, Mike's at four. All right. I'll, All right. Right. I'll, get, I'll, I'll, I'll take some. <laughs> I was. I actually, 
Mike, 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 leave, Mike, 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 leave your party. Mike, 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 leave, 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 Mike. Like 15 seconds. Not even 15 seconds. We're, we're, we're clearing, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. Good do it. Yeah, do it. Works. There we go. Nice. You guys cleared? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I sold Lotus. <laughs> finally. <laughs> finally. <laughs> He's twin holding his breath the whole time. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. Dark. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> darkness was too much. Oh, it didn't reach I, me. I'm ready when. Wow, I I swapped. Wow. I'm ready when you guys are. I am ready whenever too. I am completely swapped within my life. We're just right. waiting for me as usual. Remember when I might like, kept dying before we killed? <laughs> no, it's I died <laughs> as we killed. <laughs> oh, fair fight. What is that for? Is that ten kills? Um, uh, nothing in this corner. Nothing. I got nothing. Yeah, let's Clear. go. Ooh, I got a crossbow. Oh. I got five Meister cubes, so let's roll them on the ring and see what we get. Make sure it's the right ring. Yes, it's this ring. Nothing. Mmm, <laughs> really garbage. Really garbage. Oh my god, I swear, what is it with me? I, if that was actually a dex roll. Okay, nothing. Oh! Almost dropped it. Recently, after a couple of weeks of bosses, I've realized that I'm kind of uh, short in the department of healing familiars. None of my familiars actually have a single line of uh, uh, HP recovery that's uh, by a large amount. The best I have is... Um, you, I think. I have the large amount to nearby allies and stuff, but I think that the self-healing also stacks on top of it. I still have a thousand Oda warriors in my storage. Um, I was really planning to just sell them to make, you know, a quick two bill or so, but I think it would be better and wiser if I were to just try and get at least like a single line of large healing to myself. Before I start opening Odas, let's do a quick test here. So I'm just gonna save my familiars. Now heroes naturally heal 2000 HP every five seconds, or was it four? Wait, I can't remember. I never, uh, oh, even worse, 1500. Uh, the timer on this is like, four seconds or so, it's really bad. I wouldn't say bad, but this is like very early game. So for all intents and purposes, I'm gonna try and disregard it, but if there's like a, you know, 2000 HP discrepancy, that may be the cause. The first familiar I wanna try out is the HP and MP to nearby allies. Uh, according to a text document that I got from someone, this should be 15% of my HP. So with my current HP value, that should be around uh, 10,000 exactly. Wait, uh, let me bring out a calculator. 10,074, okay, so uh, close enough. Uh, how are we going to do this? Well. I am basically just going to go into like any random map and tank an AFK mob and then we'll just summon the familiar and we'll see what happens. And I do have safety gems so if this goes poorly, there's that. Okay, so if I heal, bring this guy up. Okay, so it does heal then. Yeah, okay, so that is 10,000 HP that I recovered. So restoring to nearby allies does work so that means the next thing i want to find out is if uh something like uh mr wang let's say will help so small amount of single hp uh it should be five percent so that would just mean another five thousand hp to me so all in all i should heal 15k uh so let's just go to another map tank a bunch of uh the AFK mobs as well. All right, I think that's good. All right, so now if I summon, did I save? Okay, good. Oh, I missed it. Uh, I'll just watch again. So there goes the passive, and I should jump up to 50,000. Yeah, close enough. Okay, so they do stack. Now the most interesting part of uh, what I wanna try is if I have like all of this random stuff, I, wa I wanna see what uh, overrides. Basically, if I heal more than 15,000 uh, HP here, then I know something's up. Uh, so again, let's just go to a random map. Oh, ah, 
my warrior link skill. Damn it. Hit me. Hit me, god damn it. Actually, this is probably a better spot here. Okay, okay, okay. So, 16k, summon familiars. Whoa. So yes, in fact, the healing does stack and that rhymed. So that's the thing, I'm not getting as much healing as I could and that means I'm not breezing through bosses as easily as I could. <laughs> that means I will start opening some Odas. Now I am a cheapskate so I will do this 10 at a time and I'm just gonna hopefully get a single line of large healing for HP. Um, wow, okay, that's that's a way to open up. Uh, nope, that's not good enough. Nope, I'm looking for... There you go, that's it. Uh, ideally I would like something else on top of it, but, uh, that's... That was basically it. Uh, 30 ignore, I mean, don't I have one of those? Yeah, I do, uh, so that doesn't matter to me. Um, no, no... No. Okay, let's open another 10. Uh, so I'll, I already got what I'm looking for, but it would be nice to get something maybe a bit better. So maybe large HP and another form of healing or just some other stat. I'm also maybe looking for item acquisition because apparently that's also a separate line that could stack with uh, drop rate. So I do have reasons to reveal... Um, my oh like this this is also something that i may want to consider <laughs> oh what a fucking lie another 10 more uh huh all right nope so again large hp and some other useful line that would be pretty good uh not that though i don't want turning my character red like what the fuck <laughs> Nope. And no. Alright, another 10 to go. No, nope. all junk. Don't care. Nope. Would be nice to see item acquisition too. Nope. And no. Alright, 10 more and I'll consider stopping. Uh, but... Who knows, maybe I will do the full stack, because this is kind of fun. <laughs> no. No. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I keep forgetting, like, there's a lot of garbage in uh, potential lines. Okay, yeah, you know what, I'll, I'll keep doing it. Uh, my limit is the full stack, uh, just because this is fun, in a way. Um, nope. No. No. <laughs> oh my god, these lines. Item draw rate right by a large amount. Nope, that, that's my wolf. My wolf gets that. Was that 10 already? Man, that goes by fast. Now I'm basically just looking for item acquisition or large HP and something. Well, that is technically better. That crit rate is like really useless so ugh, but at least it looks nice <laughs> uh huh nope item draw right no no oh okay then <laughs> i i i'm pretty happy i'm satisfied right there Okay, well, I got it. That's pretty decent, if I do say so myself. All right, well, since I have an awkward 30, I'm... You know what, I'll just open them again. Still looking for one more potential specifically. Uh, maybe we'll get it. If not, uh, doesn't matter. I'm pretty happy. All right. No. 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 Mm. Wait, oh no, that's all small. Nope, 10 more. Oh. Well, I mean, it's nice, but I don't need it. Uh, let's keep going. Darkness, nope. Jump and speed, nope. Uh, nope. No. Nope. 
Okay, and finally the last one. Ah, so I just looked it up. Um, the item acquisition rate is actually a unique line, so uh, I'm definitely not going to get it then in that case. So, oh well, I guess uh, the stack is an investment to um, oh, uh, what uh, what was it called? Familiar points, I suppose. Uh, will I get something nice though? We'll find out. Nope, and finally, no. So this was fun, but now I'm gonna say goodbye, and now I have enough points to get like six gasolines, which is pretty nice to be honest. But um, now uh, the final thing that I wanna do is I want to see the effects of the stacking now. So now I have large amount of HP and MP to nearby allies, small amount of HP, and large amount of HP. This should be another 15% uh, HP, so that means I should be healing around 30% of my uh, health, which is probably the 20,000 mark. At this point, the precise math doesn't really matter much to me. I'm just super curious to, to see how it's going to go. Uh, so, come on, stop missing. Oh my god. Okay, there we go. And more, please. Alright, there we go. Oh, fuck! Warrior Link skill confirmed bottom tier because it gets in the way of me experimenting with this shit. Actually, wouldn't the Limina mobs be, like, much more easier to deal with? Yeah, there we go. That's much better. I think it has to do with, like, the level difference or something. I can't... I forgot the formula. Anyways. Okay, one more hit. Yep, thank you. And now... 9,000, summon familiars, bump up to 30,000. Hello? Oh, there it is. Yep, so that's an upgrade, and I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, I don't really think I need any more epic familiars, so I am now going to throw all of those stacks into the ocean, I mean the auction house, so yay, Mesos.